Hi everyone, it's Piers and Andy from Me and My Golf and November has been all about training aids. This is the last one, it's the Impact Show. Andy, what are we talking about today? Right, we're finishing off the month in style. We're gonna give you three training aids to fix your golf swing fast. Don't go anywhere, let's take charge of your game. Thanks for joining us here on the 18th hole at the Asprey. We hope you enjoyed Training Aid Month. Please let us know down below what have you enjoyed the most? What was your favourite training aid of the month? And if you've enjoyed it, please hit the thumbs up. It does help us reach more golfers. And also, if you're new to the channel, please subscribe to get more videos every week. Now, we're talking, Pierce, today, how to fix your golf swing fast. Yeah. And when we're, doing, we're talking about this, it's how to get the most out of your practice sessions. A lot of golfers get to the driving range, have a basket of balls, sometimes not very purposeful practice, Pierce. Mm don't make massive changes, don't have any feedback to tell them if they're doing it wrong. So really today's video is all about how to get the very most out of your practice session. We've got some great training aids in this one. This is exciting. Yeah, we have. It is. It's really good. I mean, we would use these ourselves 100%. And this is, as you said, purposeful practice. In this video, we're talking about feedback. So giving you the best possible feedback, very easy solutions on what you're actually doing. So. Let's start off with the first one. We've got the Live View Plus. Now, we were actually introduced this. We've seen it for about, about a year ago, but we were only introduced to this a, a couple of months ago, and it's absolutely fantastic what it can do. So basically, you, you have the camera there. You can see it's down the line. We put it in the correct place for us quickly. We have it running parallel to the target line at hand height. That's going to help me with things like playing, for instance. All you do from there is you download an app, and then obviously that camera is going through your phone there. So I can see everything that we've got here. So what I'm going to do, I'm literally going to press the record button. So I want to record everything that I do now. There's lots of different ways that you can do this. So I simply place the camera on the ground, make sure I'm aiming at the middle of the green, which is where we set it to. Now, because I've got this swing plane line in already, I know instantaneously whether I'm above, under, above and then above, or under and then above, or under and then out. I can see exactly what's going on without having to look into a mirror. So I can get instant feedback with an analysis line on there, just like me and you when we're videoing someone in a golf lesson, I have it all here now. So I've got great feedback straight away. You've got that live sort of viewing of the golf swing. And this, this contraption here comes, you can put it onto the alignment stick really easy, or it comes with sort of a, a gripper that you yeah, can actually attach tripod here to a, a bag, which is really easy as well. So the great thing is it's quite simple to, to use. You can go front on, down the line, and Pierce is just obviously showing this from a down the line view. So you can do this, you can see and work at these drills knowing exactly what's going on, and then you can hit a shot and then record the golf swing and see instantly what it was like. So let's see, Pierce. Okay, so I'm just gonna actually hit a golf shot, feeling that maybe playing a little bit more of a draw, okay? So I'm doing my things I'll do for the draw, just tweak the setup a little bit. There's the draw. Straight away I look down at this. It gives me some feedback. It tells, sorry, it gives me the, the instant feedback. I can then play through this here and I can see that the club on the way back, on the way down, there's the club coming underneath the plane, swinging out to the right. So I've achieved everything that I wanted to do in that shot. So, so simple, very easy, and I just put it down and go through it again. Yeah, and I love how you're matching here the feeling to the visual. I think this is the key thing for a lot of yes. golfers who practice. They may have a certain feeling, but they've got no reference point to say that's good or bad. Whereas this one, you can sort of say, well, okay, this feels maybe a little different, but if you're watching it and it's matching exactly what you want, then it's perfect. You're really enhancing yeah. that learning process and ingraining those good habits really yeah. fast. And there's a lot of features on this, and actually we decided that next year, can we tell them about Gadget of the Month? No, not yet. Oh, don't spoil it. We're gonna do it in January anyway, so watch out for that. <laughs> okay, so that is very, very simple. We've got a couple more. So we have here the 360 mirror from Eyeline Golf, which is a great thing about this piece. It's portable, you can yes. take it with you anywhere you like. And it's sort of got this sort of fishbowl effect, so you can really access sort of full view of what yeah. the golf swings do. And we just drop this down. you having one of these everywhere you go. I take this everywhere, Pierce. <laughs> and we're gonna combine this with Selfie Golf, which is basically a holder for the mobile phone where you can actually record your golf swing. Something so simple for, um, for th that you can take to the range that you can fit on a lineman stick or even your bag. Slightly cheaper version than the, um, the live view, but equally a very good tool for you if you want to start analyzing and looking at your game. Saves your friend holding your camera still like this. Exactly, yes. <laughs> so look, Pierce, Let's combine these two and yes. show how the guys at home could use this to really get the most. Let's give an example of that, shall we? Okay, so let, let's go with the sway swing fault. So sway swing faults, we know that that is when the lower body moves excessively away from the target in the backswing. So what we've done, we've set up the selfie golf with my phone in. I've got my eye line mirror now, the good thing, sorry, the 360 mirror from eye line. What I like about this is this red line. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take my setup, 
so that my, I may close my non-dominant eye, so that my pocket is on the red line. Now, if I, have a, if I do a sway, I can see that I'm going through that red line. So what I want to do, I want to keep my pocket on that red line. That's what I want to do. But the drill, we always talk about exaggerating this, the drill I'm actually going to do is to get my pocket to go away from that red line. So you can see the exaggeration, total opposite of what my pelvis normally does. So I'll exaggerate using that mirror, get that feeling, and then when I hit the shot, I'm looking for that same exaggeration. Now, if I can actually get my hips going that way at the top of the backswing, fantastic. But if I actually get it so more than likely, I'm just going to be in a, in a pretty much perfect place and there'll be no sway. So it's the instant feedback as well, isn't it? Instant you know, saying here. Some, peop some people will be thinking, I'm, I'm not swaying there, I'm not swaying there, they're doing this. Yes. Whereas, look, there's no cheating on this. And then, yeah. then you've got the feedback once you've recorded it. So we have instant feedback here. And then obviously, as soon as we see that, we can get the feedback okay. as well. Well, let's test you out then. Let's see you hit a shot and then we'll take a look at the phone and see actually what we've got, see if we sway or not. So I'm actually going, I'm going to go for, now we know normally I don't sway. So I suppose the thing for me would be that I really want to get it going this going side on. of the red line. Normally when I do that as well, I get a bit of a draw. There it is. Let's keep watching that one, please. Mm -hmm. Moving towards the flag nicely. I will get the phone out now. Oh, good. So very simple now. Look, just take it off and then we can take a look. At exactly I'll let you what's tell me. On. I'll let you tell me. So, okay, let's take a look. So straight away here, you can see the good practice swing there, the lower body nice and stable. And then when you actually hit the shot, yep, we oh, can see that oh, your hip oh, oh. actually moves away from, the, sorry, towards the target there. That was hitting the shot. Wow, that's yeah. good. Simple. Maybe, and a good, I, I, maybe a good way to play a draw for the guys at home. 100%. Do have a sway, getting you to feel this to create a little bit more room on the way down. But I think the great thing about this, look, some instant feedback there. Yeah. You've got this visual straight away when you're practicing. You've got something that's going to help you film your golf swing and record it so you can start to look and get better at noticing some of the things and the issues that you're dealing with. This is massively important as well. I mean, I used to work in a pro shop, so we were limited on time on a busy day. You know, might be doing a 12 hour day in the pro shop, but you wanted to do some practice still. So I couldn't hit any golf balls, but the patio windows outside, the mirrors, obviously, I would use. You used to use them a lot, a lot as well, didn't you? Spent mirrors, a lot yeah. of time in those mirrors at Oxley Park, probably about five years ago, was it? <laughs> X amount of years ago, but it, get, by getting that feedback from a mirror, it really can help you ingrain movements in your golf swing without actually hitting golf balls. It does so. So three great training guys there, guys. Let us really know what good. your thoughts of that. Um, some options for you to, to look at if you want to go to the range and get, so, get more out of your practice sessions. They will definitely help. Now, also, before we go, our coaching plan, Simple Secrets, is doing amazing after the first couple of weeks. So make sure you check that out if you haven't already. A five-week coaching plan that's going to help you shoot those lower scores out on the golf course. Talking about mindset, strategy, trouble shots, sloping lies, and also game day in competition. We know you're gonna love it, so make sure you go and check that out over on our website. Thank you so much for watching. We hope you enjoyed that. Now, post down below, which of those three training aids was your favorite? Andy, which was your favorite? I think mine was the live view. I wanna use that a little bit. Yeah, more. really, really cool. So also, if you want to see the coaching plan, Simple Secrets Lower Scores, click the link in the corner, and we'll see you at me and my golf Thanks for watching.